Yo, what's going on? It's your boy, Mr. Locario, the bad boy of the dating game. What's good? So I got an email from a subscriber, and this subscriber sent a donation, so thanks for your donation. And remember, guys, if you want to guarantee that your question will be answered, make sure you click the link below and send a donation. So this one says, hey, Locario, I got a question. Now, I was wondering, how do you go about maintaining consistent eye contact with women? Ever since I was a little kid, I've had trouble maintaining eye contact with women I like. When I was a kid, it was worse, but over the years, I've gotten better, but it still needs some work. Like, for example, when I'm walking and a woman is walking towards me and looks at me briefly, I may or may not look away. My ability to maintain eye contact seems inconsistent, as with certain days where I'm feeling really confident, I can maintain strong eye contact with the woman and look at her while she's looking at me while uh, talking. And if a woman is checking me out, I'll look back till she looks away while there are other days where I'm not feeling as confident. And when I'm talking to a woman or I'll check a woman out and she see she sees me checking her out, I will look around or look away after like five or 10 seconds before she looks away. I still get that preconceived notion that if I keep staring that I'll creep a woman out. However, I feel like I've improved as when I was 19, a woman was looking at me twice and each time I kept looking away, ruining my chances of uh, getting with her. Just today, I was looking at a woman while I was on the Stairmaster because she had an ACDC shirt on at the gym and she saw me looking at her and I looked away for two or three seconds. As I was getting off the Stairmaster, the same woman walked towards me and was looking at me briefly. And I looked at her for a few seconds and I looked to my right and she looked away at the ground. And then I looked back at her and she was still looking at the ground like she was nervous or didn't want to be talked to. I talk to a lot of women and I still have this problem from time to time and I want it to be consistent. Are there any tips you can give me and other guys struggling with this problem? All right. So the thing is this, you know, in, in general, it's important, it's important to have like, you know, good eye contact when you are talking to a girl, you know, you're interacting with her, you're approaching her, you, you know, going back and forth with her. It's good to have some good eye contact. But what you got to understand is, is that good eye contact isn't necessarily you staring a chick down or you trying not to break eye contact. <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? So when you're talking to a girl, you don't got to be staring her dead in her eyes, uh, you know, the whole time. You understand? You could look away for a second and then come back to looking at her. It's not a big deal. Or let's say, you know, in your situation, you were saying that, you know, chicks would pass by or, you know, you you uh, were looking at some girl with, with the shirt on and, you know, you look this way and she looked that way and then you looked away, whatever it is. And a lot of times in those situations, um, you know, you don't necessarily have to worry too much about that. What you need to focus more on is if you see a chick you want to talk to, you go and talk to her. You understand? Don't worry about if, you know, you broke eye contact or you stopped looking at her or whatever. Because see, this is the thing. There are certain reasons as to why, you know, um, a person might break the eye contact. You understand? Because some people think, well, if you can't look the person in the eyes, uh, that means that you're insecure or that you're, you know, something wrong with you or whatever. You understand what I'm saying? And in some cases, that could be it where some people, um, you know, they feel uncomfortable looking someone in the eye. You understand? So it doesn't make them it doesn't feel good to them. You understand? So uh, that could be, you know, one of the reasons. But, you know, there's a, a number of different reasons why, like, people won't keep eye contact. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes, you know, even with myself, like when I talk to people, I'll look them in the eye, but sometimes as I'm thinking about what I'm going to say next, or like, let's say if I'm talking and I'm trying to remember something or I'm, you know, I might just be trying to, you know, bring up something or remember a word that I wanted to say, like, you know, whatever it is, you understand I might break eye contact because usually when I start thinking, I look sort of like away and then I come back to the to the person. You understand? But the thing is, it, the most important part about this whole thing is, is that you want to be able to communicate effectively. You understand? And so with the eye contact, right, you communicate certain things with just your eye contact. But what you don't want to do is you don't want to get too obsessed with 
the idea of the eye contact because what it seems like is is that you're trying to sort of like master this thing where you're able to like you know look women in the eye or look at women without stopping or without uh you know looking away or whatever and that's not really um the 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 most important thing the most important thing is what are you trying to communicate when you are you know looking at these girls or talking to these girls you understand so if you see a chick and let's say you're looking at her and then y'all, y'all, y'all uh, you know you guys lock eyes for a second right and if you look away right and then you look back, it's not a big deal. You understand what it what is a big deal is what are you trying to really do? You understand? Because if you just look at a chick, but you don't really go and approach her and say anything, then what's really the point? You see what I mean? And so some people might say, well, you know, if you look at the girl and then she looks at you and you look away, you know, it's going to make you look weak. And then if you try to go and talk to her after that, then she's not going to want to talk to you because you broke eye contact. It's, it's not that serious. <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? What What's, what's going to make you look weak really is if, if you do look at her and she looks at you and let's say you look away, but you don't go and approach her. Or let's say you do look at her and she looks at you, but you still don't go and approach her, even though you're keeping eye contact, then that's the thing that, you know, is going to make you look weak because she's going to be thinking, okay, I'm checking him out. He's checking me out. Why isn't he coming over and talking to me? So the, the most important thing is, what are you trying to communicate through the eye contact and what are you doing about it? What are you, what's the, what are you doing with that? So even if you're having that conversation with a girl, let's say you're at a bar at a party, you're interacting with this girl and y'all are like, you know, face to face, y'all talking to each other and you are keeping that eye contact or whatever, or you're, you know, um, flirting with her, you're building sexual tension, you using your eyes in the situation to keep the eye contact and to look at her and to, and to express yourself how you are, you know, um, interacting with her in that way where you're trying to flirt, you're trying to do these things, you know, that's the important part is really just you being in the situation, communicating, you understand? Because you, you want to look at it as, the eye contact is part of the entire communication. You don't want to look at it as, you know, it's this separate thing that you're doing. You understand? Or the separate thing that you're trying to make happen and that you have to like try to master it. You understand what I'm saying? Now, there are situations where if let's say you are nervous or you are sort of shy and you have trouble looking a woman in her eye, then that's one thing. You understand? But if you're having a conversation with the woman, you don't need to stare at her in her eyes without breaking eye contact for like the whole 10 minute conversation or however long you're talking to her. Or if you are, you know, let's say in a bar and you see a girl across the room, you don't have to just keep, you know, staring at her nonstop. (laughs) You understand what I'm saying? And not do anything. You know what I mean? So again, it's, it's, is a combination of the eye contact, but everything else you're doing with it. You see what I'm saying? So, you know, don't worry too much about just the eye contact. Understand that, you know, it's that with a combination of all the other things and understand you don't need to like be on some super intense, super crazy eye contact when you're talking to a girl. You know, it's okay to look away for a second and then come back to the interaction. You feel me? Now, before you turn off this video, I want you to do three quick things. One, I want you to click the link below to send me a question. If you have a question on dating and relationships, I'll make a video about it. Two, I want you to click the link under that to get my free audio program, Undeniable Game, which teaches you seven easy to follow tips on how to really attract beautiful women. And three, I want you to click the link under that one to go to Bad Boy Membership, where you get 45 through 90 minute audio and video dating advice tutorials every month. What's up? It's dating and life coach, Mr. Locar. Go to badboymembership.com and master the dating game by joining my Bad Boy Membership Program. In this program, you'll receive 45 through 90 minute, easy to follow, step-by-step dating advice tutorials that's guaranteed to help you attract, date, and have sex with beautiful women. Join the Bad Boy Membership today by going to badboymembership.com. That's badboymembership.com.